Yo guys, it's Jim and Brian here from Drink a Beer and Play a Game, and we are here with our 16th podcast. Today's topic, the Fine Brothers and our reaction to- OH! WHAT THE FUCK?! Shut the fuck up, that has nothing to do with beer and games that has been done to death! Brian, we have to put our first spin on it! Ah! God! Pick something else. Anyway, the real topic of today's video is Pokemon hitting its 20th anniversary, and our basic experiences with it. So let's change it up and let's have Bry go first. Well, this will be fairly fast. Um, I gotta be honest, as a kid, never a fan of Pokemon. Had plenty of friends who played the shit out of it. It wasn't for me. It wasn't until, I wanna say, six months ago, I actually borrowed, which one was it, Jim? Fire Red. Yeah, I borrowed that from Jim, and I'd say I put in a solid six hours most of them were spent while i was on the toilet or on the train and i can see why it's so goddamn addicting i've played enough other rpgs and in my opinion better games where i just don't feel like grinding it out but for back in the day when you had a mobile game i totally see the appeal and i can understand it now what happened with the merchandising the tv shows and all the goddamn spin-offs I still think it's a little ridiculous to this day. It's a phenomenon! I'm just happy that little fad seems to have gone away. And I'm calling it a fad, and I know there are fanboys out there, but I don't care. But for me, it, it was what it was. It's cool that it became as big as it did for so many people. But like I said, it's just not a game for me. I see the appeal, and kudos to that game. And, if, and I'm assuming they still release new ones, Jim? Yep. Yeah, so... If you're a big Pokemon fan, let us know below, but Jim, I'm sure, will go much more in depth because he has a whole lot more experience with it. Because he's a nerd. Hey! God damn it! Alright, so, also, like Brian, I didn't play Pokemon as a kid. I kind of thought it was for kids a lot younger than me, even though when it came out, I was, I think, 12. So, looking back, that's kind of funny to think about. But, or maybe it was because of the TV show. I don't know. Anyway, I didn't really start playing it until I was probably about 18 or 19. So, Jesus Christ, that's 10 years ago already. Anyway, I was hanging out with a bunch of friends, and we all had the idea one night that we were going to get into Pokemon. I didn't grow up with a Game Boy or with Pokemon, so I had to go out and buy both. Which, hey, it gave me a reason to get a black Game Boy Advance, so can't complain about that. And I started playing Pokemon Red, and I fell in love with it. I must have put about 150 some hours into that game, running around trying to collect everything. The fact that it made it that you had to buy both versions of the game, which was highway robbery, but completely genius on their part in order to get everything. It just made you want to go out, play more, find people to play with. Hell, it gave me Pokemon Stadium, which I played the shit out of with friends, loading up my teams and trying to go against other people and what they did. And goddamn Snorlax is going to bed and being tanks and goddamn Nerd! All right, all right, all right, all right. And actually, those are the only two I really played for a while. I eventually picked up Soul Silver, uh, Fire Red, but yeah, I've only played about maybe four or five Pokemon games total. But they've all been huge time sinks. I guess I don't mind grindy games, so I can just sit there and do battles over and over and over again. Hell, I think I've probably faced the Elite Four in Pokemon Red about I don't know a hundred sometimes. Anyway. I, it's a great series. I'm not going to go out and play every single one because I don't have that kind of time anymore. It's obviously a cultural phenomenon, and I think it deserves all the praise it's gotten. Even if, yes, the merchandise is a little nuts. So, that does it for this topic. Please leave comments below about your experiences with Pokemon. Do you like it? Do you not like it? What got you into it? You know, all that jazz. And as always, leave more comments, and you can hit us up on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, or email with drinkabeerandplayagame at gmail.com. Cheers, guys. Cheers.